What is up guys, Shinchi42 here and today we are going to be capturing the altar. So this is the first time that I am going to be able to record capturing of altar. Um, this is the surge altar and we are going to get troop defense by 3% and this is the first occupational reward. So the first occupation reward, this is when you first capture it, right? So we are going to receive that as soon as we capture it. And um, currently we have one altar here that we can obtain and then two um three and four so uh another here is the bewitcher will lead the rally here wow there's not a lot here but there bewitcher is a very strong um guy already here uh he is uh our top guy here he is our muscle <laughs> but he is uh, an amazing guy i've talked to him on discord He's such a cool dude um he, they are going to capture the earth altar which is going to be increasing the building speed by five percent right correct is it five percent yes it is so another thing here that we have here, we have another one here that's going to be led by Ridiculousness. So ridiculous! <laughs> but he is going to be uh, the one to rally this. What is he going to be capturing here? It's the Wisdom Altar. So this is going to be increasing the research speed by 5%. And I believe they're all the same rewards anyway. Right, there's a lot of rewards and we're going to get all these guys. It's freaking amazing. Such a great milestone for the Royal Knights. Uh, here would be led by Veil Dissolve, and uh, here is the member that are participating in his um, attempt towards the Storm Altar. This is going to be the training speed by 5%. The Storm Altar is training speed and the same amount of uh, resources that you can obtain. Now, I can just like move around, right, using this by clicking the star and move around to the marker that, where I'm going to want to go. So I'm going to go to the defense marker because that's where I am supposed to be leading. And yeah, so here it is. We got six minutes and uh, we're going to be capturing it. So I am super excited. There's more members here. I don't know why, but because maybe because all, all, everyone is already camped in this area. Some members actually teleported, but if they have a hard time on one side, we will have to teleport to um, a system over there. But I believe this one is going to be a, such an easy, easy approach. So my approach here is that I'm going to scout the search altar first so that uh, we can show it on YouTube and to you guys, to the viewers, what type of units are going to be in the search altar. And um, currently I have about my castle size. Let me show it to you guys how much I have here. It's level 16. So I have about 850k rally army capacity, but I need more books of covenant. So I would definitely have to buy... Uh, I bought everything already in here that has Book of Covenant because when you try to purchase on the VIP 8, not no Book of Covenants there and uh, VIP 9 as well. So you have to wait until VIP 10 to get that 1000 Book of Covenant. And then I think you don't get, get it for a while until, let's say, VIP 13. So yeah, VIP 13, you get 2K of uh, Book of Covenant. And then when you go to VIP 14, you get another 2K. And the VIP 15, you don't get anything. So yeah, so make sure you have a good rally size so that your members can participate in the um, in the rally because the rally is really the best thing here so that you don't have to heal a lot of units. So here we go, guys. It is one minute left. And uh, let's go in and check on what's happening on the other side of the on the map. There's only three here, but Witch Bewitcher can definitely easily take this on by himself. So in here, we have Bewitcher, Bitter Light, same turkey and then when we go to the other side there's a lot more over here being led by ridiculousness and so as you can see they're already um, in that area and then to veil i think the, the time is about up so with veil there's also players here right there's also some players in here there we go so let's go ahead and go back and make sure we scout it go ahead and scout there we go. Make sure we put up a marker so that everyone is not confused with what is going on. All right, so I sent out my scout. There we go. You can see Shinchi 42 scout is over there. They're pretty quick because I have Japan still. There we go. So there is about um, tier two unit, their cavalry. So you kind of want to just send the archer, but you know, we're just going to charge it with anything that we got right now. Um, we're going to set up a rally now. And let's do a five minute rally. And then let's go to, uh, let's go use uh, my, this is my best commander currently. So we're going to use Kosu. You know what? I'm going to use um, Minamoto instead. And then we're going to set up a rally now. 
I'm gonna remove my T1 units because they're really practically useless. So remove the T1 units and then remove some of the T2 units. So it's only like T3 units. And then there we go. So we'll send some siege, who cares? I don't have a lot of troops because we just recently had a big war and um, lost a lot of troops. That's why I purchased some of the bundles here and I'm excited to use them. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, I think these are cavalry units and they look like they're cavalry, they're, they look pretty buff. Uh, there we go, so let's, we can double check on it by going to the cavalry. I, sh I should be training some archers right now. But yeah, we can go back here and then check on it. So yeah, they are tier 2 units, they are light cavalry that are inside it. So sending a bunch of infantry would be helpful, but at this stage they're really weak compared to us right now because we got T4, I got like T4 units now. So that's something that uh, we can definitely handle. You can see everyone's reinforcing. Let's go ahead and double check how people are responding to the uh, reinforcement. So in here, we can uh, we can uh, access that real quick. So let's go check on mine. So they've already have filled a lot in the position here in the, uh, in the uh, rally. So they got tier two units, tier three units, sorry, tier three, tier three, tier three. I should have not sent any tier two units. Tier did I send tier two units? No, I sent tier three, okay. So a bunch of tier three units here, a few tier tier two, a few tier two here as well. There we go, guys. These are the participants of this event. Um, all right, so with Veil Dissolve being the lead, oh, he's got Richard, wow, good, good, man. Um, he's got some participant here sending tier two. Oh, Pika Pika has got that 40K. Um, this is like uh, infantry T4 units. Uh, some more T3, very good, very good response. I haven't seen any T1 really, or did I see T1 earlier? I don't think so, but uh, let's double check. I don't think I saw any T1 units so far, unless I'm, uh, I need to get some sleep, but no, I don't think I saw any T1. So good job for the members because that's what we've instructed them. Um, try to send at least T T3 or T4 units if you have no choice, send T2 units. All right, so with here with ridiculousness, here's the participant. I don't see any T1 as well. Very good job for everybody. You can see that a lot of very, very active alliance. Actually, we only have one inactive so far. Well, sadly, we did have one, but but it is very good for us. So we got about two minutes before it hits. And with, with Bewitcher, why is he the only one in here? People need to rally Bewitcher. So I need to come over there and um, set a marker for Oh, he did cancel it, so... Uh, we got to make sure that they um, also reinforce Bewitcher's uh, rally. What is going on? I mean, he can definitely just take it all by himself easily as well. Um, let's go ahead and uh, put a marker here. I don't wonder what is not being used. So one, two, three, four, five. So let's go in and use this defense marker. Um, make sure, make sure you rally. You reinforce rally or just hit it. Ah, hit or just hit. There we go. I think he can handle it easily. He can definitely just hit it by himself. There we go. He's got he's got T four units. This is easy easy win for him. Uh, all right, so we got about a minute. Let's go and watch what's going to happen here with Bewitcher just hitting it by himself. Easy, easy battle for him. Uh, you can see he's got the Hannibal Barca and I think the Julius Caesar as a secondary commander. We got to keep track of what's going on over here as well. So there's about a minute left. All right, so I think he can capture this within a minute. Um, wow, I am uh, so amazed right now. Seeing how he is performing, amazing, uh, good job, Bewitcher. There we go. So they're gonna be the one, the first to capture this. Wow. There we go, guys. So we have about uh, a minute, a minute left. I just had some pop out there. Sorry, guys. That was Discord. All right, a minute left. I think I said a minute left, 30 seconds left, 30 seconds left. There we go. And a victory, we got it. And then they're doing a good job here as well with the ridiculousness. There is about, I can't see it. There's about 800 something K troops in there. 
and the next that we have to check is for veil dissolve i think we're gonna hit it first over here Alright, so where is my rally? I think my rally hasn't set out to march yet. So we've captured one already. We're going to capture two soon. Alright, we're going to capture the second one soon. Really good. Getting all these goodies, rewards in, in, this, in, this, uh, in this alliance. Alright, good job. Great work, everybody. Great work from RK. So uh, Vale is uh, also attacking already. He's got 749k 700, uh, troops over here. And then my troop, I'm kind of late. Um, we're marching about a minute now. So, uh, well, I was late, but it's fine. <laughs> um, here we go. So as you guys see, you can click that and then you can send ra send reinforcement to the rally. That's how you guys can support the rally itself. They're doing a great job here. Um, well, very strong commander of having that Richard. As you can see, Pika is going to go in into the rally. I think he's going to reinforce. If he disappear here, he's going to be reinforcing, which I guess he's not doing the reinforcement, unfortunately. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Uh, we got 44 seconds till we hit over there. Let's go and check that. 44 seconds. They're trying to reinforce. Indoctrine is going to be reinforcing it. We have about, about close to like uh, 40k, just rounding it off, rounding it down, or rounding it up, whatever. Um, let's go to the storm altar again. Let's see what is going on before uh, before we hit. They are going to be capturing this. Well, we did it in sequence, right? From the top right towards the top, and then going to the left, and then now we're going to hit from the bottom as well. It's like uh, it was like a counterclockwise type of approach. Nice. So next we are going to hit over here. There we go, guys. This is my commander with uh, Yi Song Ye and uh, Minamoto. Let's see how fast we can actually capture it. And uh, let's see with Minamoto, uh, with the Yi Song Ye casting, you can see the damages. Wow. Once it hits, you can see the damage really went down for the, the life of the uh, the Surge Altar. Uh, the Calvin is not doing the, uh, the Calvin is not going to stand against us in here. Wow. Great job from everybody. Quick, quick win here. So we're going to get a lot of rewards and I'm going to be showing it to you guys. Victory. <laughs> Once you, you you capture it, your troop goes inside, and then now you start getting um, the scouts that that are happening from your own alliance. It's kind of like a bug that they have there. But now we have to like demolish the flags that are connected into our um, sanctum now. Uh, another thing that I want to show you guys, like I said, I'm going to show you guys the first occupation that we got. There we go. We got the first occupation here. 1,500 gems, one targeted teleport, 100, 130 minute speed ups, and all these goody resources in the, mil in the millions, right? In the millions. That's a lot of resources. There we go. Two, three, and then four. Four resources. Four of these, sorry, four of these uh, first occupational rewards. So one thing that I love to do after an accomplishment like this is to send out a mail and saying, great work, everybody. Great work. Good job, all RK. Just a simple message like that is going to increase or boost the morale of the players, right? Coming from the leader. There we go. We are now attacking the flag. I just didn't realize that the other one was not actually connected. So we only have one flag that's connected, the OWO. And um, what we're going to do is we're going to be building a flag here, I suppose. Oh, yeah, we definitely are going to be building a flag because there is a wood uh, log here. And we would want to capture that. And then we're going to be trying to demolish their fortress here as well for, um, you know, security reasons. And also we're trying to capture as much resource land as we can. So as we need to... Um, be searching for it. Uh, there is a wood lot here as well. So I don't know. I really am not the builder here in this alliance. I uh, kind of took a little bit of a step back on, the, you know, taking a lot of roles in here. So we've kind of delegated things in here. And, um, you know, that person would be Snow. Uh, he is going to be our uh, master. He is actually our master builder. So whatever he did here, he did a really great job and he planned a lot of things. So as you can see, we are quite, um, our, our territory is very huge. And a lot of these are all resource points, and he is doing a great job. Amazing, amazing. Very, very lucky as a leader to have one of those type of uh, members or a uh, type of uh, officers that I could that we have obtained. Um, as you guys can see, this is only at the level one pass, right? We already have 24k uh, per hour and 28k per hour for wood, 22k.5 for stones, and 15k alliance gold per hour. 
So we are, yeah, look at him. He is the master builder. As you can see, he is mostly the one that is building. But you can't see the entire history, though. But I think it resets. But he is the one that really built a lot of flags for us. So, guys, we have some DK in here in this uh, um, altar here. They are going to be capturing it as well. Um, I'm still waiting for their rally. I, I don't know where the rally is. Good job for DK. And um, let's check out the other alliances here. Um, let's kind of be fair for the Hill Kingdom. Let's see what the FAM Alliance, the Juggernauts, did. If they have captured it already. Um, they are going to capture it as well over here. So you guys can see the FAM Alliance. Wow, there's a lot of them in here. Wow, good job, guys. Good job. Good work, good work. All right, so what else is in here that we can see? Let's check out LK. If I have the map scouted. Um, yeah, over here, the LK. Let's see if they are going to be capturing this soon. Ah, no one's here. What the hell, LK? Maybe they're busy on the another um, on their, uh, altar here. Okay, so who else can we see? Can we watch? Ooh, what is going on here? Maybe somebody is trying to capture here in this area. Which alliance are these guys? There? No, this is a Sanctum. What? The Sanctum is not being captured? What the hell? Um, in here, what is going on over here? This is the ROG. All right, so we've, oh, these are the doves. So we got some dove in here. Right, good job, good job for the Dove Alliance. And um, what else have I not scout scouted here? Um, let's see, um, what's going on over here on this side? This is the ES Alliance. Uh, no one's here, unfortunately. DA Alliance. Um, over here, what alliance is in here? No one's in here, guys. No one. Oh, no one. No one. Unfortunately. Uh, we kind of went around the kingdom already, and um, we saw that the Juggernauts are going to be capturing it, and as well as the DK Alliance, which is part of our family. Um, the Fam S. Let's see what the Fam S is doing over here. Are they contending with somebody? They are. I guess they're going to be capturing it easily for them. There is uh, no competition there, I guess, unless the Rust is going to be competing with them. Um, let's see if the DK already have a rally set in here. Uh, all right, they had the rally set and they are attacking with the dirty southern dirty south hard with 3rd. <laughs> okay. Anyway, there it is and Da Vinci Soul is attacking the altar by himself and uh we've got some players here. They're just standing. They should be moving or trying to attack or getting close to the reinforcement is, uh, you know. Uh, the thing that I want to kind of give you guys some advice, you guys should defeat the Guardians first so that you guys can get some runes. Like what I did is I was able to obtain a rune, Rune of Fury, before I set up my rally. There we go. Some of them are reinforcing the, uh, well, I guess they weren't reinforcing. Where? Here, here. Al Bogey is going to be reinforcing. Madame Vicious is actually just attacking the Harvest Altar. So they're going to get, the Harvest Altar is going to give you some resource production buff in here. Good work, guys. Now they are, you know, active. Maybe they kind of was idle for a while. Good job for the Dark Knights on capturing the Altar here. Good job. Lightning Thief is about to rain forth, but he is late and they were already captured it. Good job. Good work, guys. Good, good job. Um, let's see if the LK is going to be do, doing anything. I should see some Altars here, right? The, where is the LK? Right here. So maybe they are on this side. Nope. What is going on with the LK? Where are they? Where are the LK guys? So where is another altar that they have access to? So I think this is their territory. Maybe this is another territory that they have. All right, seems like they are here. The LK guys are here. There's Huang Boss, Sensai, and um, who else? I guess they are still organizing themselves over here. Um. I know they have a multiple points of uh, capturing. I'm trying to. Oh, I did. Oh, wow. They did already capture this altar here. I believe this is LK. They got the research speed, the wisdom of altar. Wisdom altar, I guess. Sorry. Wisdom altar. Um, yeah, there we go, guys. So, really good job for the kingdom. One, two, five, three. Great work from everybody here. Uh, hopefully, we can see the progression uh, throughout the kingdom. Hopefully, we are going to be a successful kingdom. And uh, make sure to check out the monument. And you can see that 
we have achieved the altar now. So your alliance control an altar at the end of the countdown. So nice, we've already captured one, but I don't think you can see how many uh, we have captured in here compared to like in the Sanctum. Uh, the Sanctum, you can see, where is that? Oh, you can't even check it, right? I thought you can, or is it this? Nope. Oh, here, wait, this is the alliance flag built. This is six how many members? We got 71 members and the Sanctum? No, yeah, here, for four Sanctum, four Royal Knights. Maybe at the end of this, it will show us the View Alliance option. So we'll see.